Hey guys, Kiefer here with Entertainment Buddha, and I'm doing a quick video to help out some people that are playing Fallout 4 right now. It's kind of a minor issue, but I've noticed not just myself has run into this. I actually ran into this last night. Uh, I recently wanted to play Fallout 4 again to try and play it a different style and check out some of the new mods since Bethesda has that Bethesda net mod stuff. Um, and I noticed that my Pip-Boy, which will be on screen right now, was all blurred and smudgy and really, really hard to read. It was almost as if somebody punched it and the lights went out in the center of it. So I tried to change the color of it, I tried to change the resolution, I tried to uninstall mods. None of that stuff was really helping. But I think I found a perfect fix for it. And this will only work for me, but it might help others too. So what I did is I went into Options, and then under Options I went to Advanced, which is right under the Reset button. You're going to go all the way down to Ambient Occlusion. Most people are going to have it set to either Off or SSAO. Now, I noticed when I had it set to SSAO, I was running into the Pip-Boy issue. But if I changed it to HBO, HBAO+, Plus, the issue resolved itself. Or if I had it off. Uh, and I found out that this is caused by GE Force's newest uh, drivers. And while this hasn't affected everybody, it has affected some other people. Um... And if you have a, a high-end graphics card, I highly recommend doing HBAO+. If you're running a 980 or higher, you should be able to do this with no problem and not notice any severe issues with frame rate dips or performance overall on your PC. If you don't feel comfortable or if you notice a performance dip that you don't care for, you can just turn it straight to off and you'll also have this fix. Now, if you want to kind of go in the middle of the road and still use SSAO, there is still an option for it. All you have to do is uninstall the, pre, the uh, current NVIDIA GeForce drivers and go back one step, and that should fix the issue as well. Uh, these drivers that they made recently for, for the new Deus Ex game and uh, for No Man's Sky. So if you aren't playing either of those games, you could technically go back a step. I always like to keep my, um, my graphics card up to date just because it might fix other issues with other games. Uh, but yeah, this has been the only issue I've seen is with Fallout 4 right now. And like I said, just set that to HBO A+, HBAO+, sorry, and then uh, you should be fine. Or like I said, just turn it straight off. Uh, I don't know if any other games have been affected, like I said. It causes your launcher to stop and crash, mind you, once you change the settings. So all you gotta do is reopen Fallout 4, and I'll show you the fix right now. As you can see, my Pip-Boy is working beautifully. Everything looks fine. I'm not running into any other graphical issues that are caused uh, because of the graphics driver. So, like I said, if you run into that issue with your Pip-Boy, make sure to change your ambient inclusion, and you'll be perfectly set. All right, guys, this is all from me for Entertainment Buddha, saying thanks, and I'll talk to you soon.